What's more consistent than your morning coffee? The global economy, of course, but we're not talking about a steady rise. Buckle up, ladies and gentlemen, as we dive into a three-year economic slowdown. Now, you might be thinking, three years? That's a long time. And you'd be absolutely right. The World Bank recently dropped a prediction that might just make your coffee go cold. They forecast that the global economy will slow down for a third consecutive year in 2024. You heard that right. We're looking at a projected growth of just 2.4%. This is a significant drop from the 2.6% growth we saw in the previous year, 2023. And the difference is even more stark when you compare it with the 3% growth in 2022 and a whopping 6.2% in 2021. But what's causing this slowdown? Well, it seems that global tensions are playing a significant role. Conflicts in regions like Israel and Ukraine are posing a risk to even weaker growth. The world's economic engine is sputtering under the strain of these international disputes. But that's not all. The World Bank is also shedding light on another pressing issue. Heavily indebted poor countries are finding it increasingly challenging to invest in climate change measures and poverty alleviation. This is a concern that needs immediate attention, as it could potentially exacerbate the economic slowdown. So as we sip on our morning brew, remember, the global economy is also in dire need of a pick-me-up. The economy is a global game of chess, and the players, the US, China, EU, and Japan. But who's making the right moves? Let's start with the US, the pace setter in 2023, leading the global growth with a 2.5% rise. Yet the year 2024 might see a deceleration to 1.6%, courtesy of higher interest rates. On to China, the dragon of the East. In 2023, it roared with a 5.2% growth, but the dragon might growl a bit softer in 2024, with projections showing a dip to 4.5%. The decline in the property market, coupled with consumer sentiment and an aging population, are the culprits here. Next up, we have the EU and Japan, both showing modest growth. The Eurozone is expected to putter along with a 0.7% growth in 2024. Meanwhile, Japan, the land of the rising sun, is forecasted to grow at a slightly better pace of 0.9%. While the chess pieces are moving, it seems like checkmate is far from sight. Economies are like roller coasters full of ups, downs, and unexpected turns. So what's the next big drop on this ride? As we peer into the future, the World Bank predicts a decrease in global inflation. However, the ride could get bumpier if a conflict erupts over Taiwan, with potential costs amounting to a staggering 10% of global GDP. Meanwhile, across the pond, BlackRock rings the alarm bell over the UK. Their worry? The risk of increased spending promises by political parties, which could lead to a revolt in the bond market, turning a leisurely ride into a dizzying spin. But not all tracks seem daunting. China's central bank, for instance, is signaling a willingness to keep the policy loose, lowering reserve requirements for banks. This move could potentially cushion the ride, providing some much needed relief amidst the economic slowdown. As we move forward, these predictions and risks will shape our journey. But remember, like any roller coaster, economies have their highs and lows. So as we ride this economic roller coaster, remember to hold on tight and don't forget to enjoy the ride. Enjoyed the ride so far? Then don't be shy, hit that like button. If you're intrigued by the twists and turns of global economics, why not spread the word? Share it with your friends and peers. And for your regular dose of insight and wit, do subscribe to our channel. Remember, knowledge is power, and by subscribing, you're just a click away from your next power up.